hello everyone today in the chemical engineering process simulation we are going to learn how to simulate a chtr and in this we are going to use a reaction for which we know the rate law so example that we are going to use in this tutorial will be acetic acid production from acetic anhydride the reaction for this process is one mole of acetic anhydride reacts with water plus one mole of water to produce two mole of acetic acid here the process parameter that is required to simulate are reactant steam which will be 50% mole by mole mixture of water and acetic anhydride at 25 degree C and 1 bar at a flow rate of 100 kg per hour. And the thermodynamics that we are going to use will be NRTL. The reaction volume will be 0.1 meter cube and the reaction kinetics that is given to us. The rate of reaction will be equal to some constant into concentration of water into concentration of acetic anhydride. And the K is given to us is 12 liter uh, per mole into second so these are all the parameters given to us so in this tutorial our objective is to find the conversion of the acetic anhydride we will choose it as a base component and to know how to simulate a reaction with a rate law and to simulate a CSTR so these three will be the output of this tutorial now let's go and open the DWC I already opened it now click on new steady state simulation so uh, simulation setup wizard will open. Click on next, select water. Acetic anhydride and acetic acid. Here you can confirm all the three compounds are added. Click on next in property package, choose NRTL. In the system of units, choose C5. Behavior, leave it undo and click on finish. Now drag a material stream to the flow sheet click on this so there will uh, rename it as a reactant stream we know reactant stream is at 25 degree C one bar pressure and uh, and will be at 100 kg per hour of flow rate Click on compound amount. Here we know water and acetic acid are present in equal amount. So I give them one. Sorry, acetic anhydride and there is no acetic acid. Now I'll click on normalize. See two things. Compound amount by default is in mole fraction. So when I choose equal amount, one one, or if I give it as another number two two also, it will normalize it to zero point five because it is the equal mole mixture of water and acetic anhydride. Now we'll click on accept the change now the change are accepted the properties for the reactant stream are calculated now i will click go to the reactor in reactor i will choose cstr i will add the cstr to the stream flow sheet and now i will rename it as a product so the output of cstr as a product now i need now the next step is to add the reaction to the system so i will click on settings in, therm in the reactions there is a default set in this default set uh, when i click on this plus button i will see three reactions to add a reaction conversion equilibrium kinetics or heterogeneous catalyst we want to simulate a kinetic reaction we will click on this kinetic reaction will open we will name it as hydrolysis of acetic anhydride production of description we will write production of acetic acid it doesn't really matter you can name it as a or b whatever you want to do but this helps you to identify the reactions when you revisit your simulation files why i will uh, for what purpose or why i will add this or what is the description you can write so that when you come back you can know about what is going on now the base component as we discussed will be acetic anhydride because you can choose any base component uh, the conversion will be uh, based on that means like base component is what you want to be in the base now for stoichiometry what i will do we know one mole of water it will have minus one well, this two mole of acetic anhydride from the one mole of acetic anhydride this two mole of acetic acid now you can say stoichiometry is okay now next thing we need to decide is direct order and reverse order so direct order means when we have a reversible reaction the forward reaction Suppose we have a A plus B gives to C a reversible reaction. So A plus B gives to C is the forward reaction. C decomposes 
z to give a plus b will be the reverse reaction so here what i will say for the forward reaction uh, in case of re uh, irreversible reaction there is only one forward reaction the reaction will be in one direction so for this we only have direct order in direct order we will see uh, as this reaction is direct order and we know the from the rate law it is given k into ca into cw so you see the power of ca in the rate law is one similarly the concentration of water also has a power one so the order with respect to these two will be one so i will simply put what not one acetic acid has a power zero now uh, we will come to this com the next problem that is kinetics parameter here at base component acetic anhydride no need to change but our basis is molar concentration the minimum temperature in kelvin i want 25 degree that means 298 kinetic specification you want only simple in advance you can uh, you can select or add a python script but we are not gonna do here we will gonna see the simple one simple i don't know the arrangements i just know it is this now next reverse reaction there is no reverse reaction only direct reaction is there and now i will go to here you can see <clears throat> this is the this is the given for the energy when you have a arrangement equation like k equal to a e uh, exponential minus e a by r t so in this case uh, this is the units of e but we only know is that it is constant so we are directly select the user defined constant my amount unit will be concentration will be in mole per liter and my rate law will be more liter per second rate units i will click on ok this is added now what will i do i will go to chtr in chtr i will have one energy stream one product one reaction industry i want to conduct the reaction in isothermic mode and the reactor volume is 0 0.1 now what will happen that is this is zero reactor pressure drop is zero and amount of catalyst is zero because these properties are not known to be what i will do now i will uh, to for your reference what i will do i will insert a master property table because i just want to know the conversion So here I will has a master property table. I will go to it. I will add this in this one. Uh, we are gonna add a reactor. So continuous stirred tank CSTR. CSTR. Here what I want conversion of acetic anhydride. I will select this. Now you will see conversion is 99.69 percentage for 0 0.1 meter cube of the reactor volume. And if you uh, want to see if what is the what is the concentration, other things, just click on master property table. Add. Here I want to know about the product stream. What? temperature pressure molar flow mass flows and the concentrations so i will want to know the molar fraction of water molar fraction of acetic acid and molar fraction of acetic acid you can see all molar fractions are given here molar flow mass flow as mass is neither created nor destroyed in a chemical reaction until and unless it is a a nuclear reaction so mass is constant you have a molar flow and you know the it is almost the pure acetic acid because the concentration of water and acetic anhydride is too very low so this is almost the acetic acid so this is how we simulate a CSTR uh, in the PW film and also the reaction whose rate law we know how to add that rate law and how to simulate it so this is for this tutorial. Thanks.